Next, we'll crochet the eucalyptus leaf part C of our sunflower bouquet, using sage green yarn and a 2-5mm hook. Start with working into a magic ring. For the first round, we'll crochet 7 single crochet stitches, ending with a total of 7 stitches. I'll demonstrate the first and second stitches, and you should complete the remaining 5 stitches on your own. After finishing the round, Tighten the ring, remove the stitch marker, and make a slip stitch into the first stitch. This concludes our first round. For the second round, we'll crochet a pattern consisting of single crochet stitches, half double crochet stitches, and half double crochet increase stitches, ending with a total of 15 stitches. Let me show you. Begin with a chain stitch. Crochet one single crochet stitch. Then in the same stitch, crochet one half double crochet stitch. Continue with two half double crochet increase stitches. Then continue in the same stitch to crochet 3 half double crochet stitches here. Next, crochet 2 half double crochet increase stitches. Then in the next stitch, crochet one half double crochet stitch followed by one single crochet stitch in the same stitch. Yeah. Remove the stitch marker, make a slip stitch, then crochet another chain stitch. Yeah. Here, our sea leaf is finished. Leave a 3 cm tail of yarn and cut the yarn to end. A total of 4 sea leaves are to be crocheted. Please complete the remaining 3 sea leaves on your own here.